You know, I think, I think maybe if this keeps up, the work plot. What are you doing back here? Get over to the Universal Petroleum HQ and try Just mark the location of some nearby fuel for you. This will be useful once we recruit mercenaries who can deliver supplies to us in the field and deliver airstrikes. This road runs all the oh, way around the south. lake. West takes you to Maracaibo, east gets you to Caracas. If you're ever feeling a little bit lost, come back to the PMC and talk to me. I might be able to offer you a few suggestions. Hey man, is that Chris Jacobs? of a nearby airstrike munition. Airstrikes are expensive, so you should think about acquiring them out in the field if you find them. However, at the moment, you don't have a helicopter pilot. You'll need one before you can have the munition delivered back to the PMC.
city limits of Maracaibo. This is the home of Universal Petroleum and they've got this place locked down pretty well with hired mercs. The UPHQ is in the northern part of the city. Need to speak to your boss. Got the guns you guys lost. Who's asking? Jacobs. I got business with Reuben. Oh, right. You're the Merc Solano shot in the ass. Hey, thanks for the guns. But Dr. Reuben? You know, she's got us. Maybe she don't need you. Figure she'll be pretty pissed she finds out you chased me off. Especially after I went to all the trouble to recover these weapons you weekend warriors lost. Tell you what. Do us one more solid, and I'll buzz you in. I'm listening. We need you to retrieve some high-end equipment. Classified tech, can't say much. The eggheads at our satellite facility whipped it up. Just get over there and tell them you're there for the Devastator. Bring it here, and we're square. How many hoops do I have to jump through for these guys? Just keep your eyes on the prize. Dr. Rubin knows about Blanco. This will get you a meeting with her. Yeah, I love meetings. They're sending you to a UP defensive position. It's in the middle of a hotspot where BZ and UP are duking it out. I've marked the man in charge. This will be over soon. for the Devastator. Yeah, the Devastator. <laughs> right, uh, over there. I see it. Unbelievable. You have got to be kidding me. <laughs> this isn't funny. Well, I think it's pretty funny. That's because... You don't look like an idiot. Enemy sighted! They just don't pay me enough. Oh, be careful! I'm taking that car! It's like working for frat boys. You wanted to stay and find Solano. That means you have to ride the little pink bike.
I'll do something. Job done. Now quit your bitching and go see Dr. Ruben. Monolith towering above everything in Maracaibo is the headquarters of Universal Petroleum. You'll find Dr. Yeah, Ruben huh? in there. I must say you're being completely unreasonable. There's over 2,000 people here. How could we possibly get them all out in six hours? Listen, why don't we meet and talk about this in person? I can have a car pick you up, we can get a latte, and... Damn. Sounds like you've got a problem. You're the mercenary my security people told me about. Chris Jacobs. Well, I'm glad you're here. This presents a fantastic opportunity. Welcome to Universal Petroleum. I'm Dr. Rubin. Are you available for a contract right now? I am, but I need something from you. Anything you need, I can provide. I'm here with only one instruction. Keep the oil flowing. I'm empowered to use any and all methods, including you. I'm looking for a guy named Blanco. Blanco. I'm familiar with him. When Solano has bad news for us, he sends Blanco. I had my people try to set up a meeting with him, but apparently he's meeting with some of Carmona's brass later. Where? That you're gonna have to find out for yourself. You help me out, and I'll tell you when the meeting's happening. Then you'll just have to find out where. The local gorillas might know more. They've been after Blanco for a while. All right, let's hear it. Mr. Solano is pursuing an aggressive strategy of corporate disincentivization. His men kidnapped my marketing VP, Victor Contreras, and are threatening to kill him if Universal Petroleum doesn't leave Venezuela within the next six hours. Six hours? I don't think Solano's men are particularly bright. They call me regularly from Victor's cell phone. I'm going to loan you my helicopter pilot, Ewan. Ewan can drop listening posts that allow you to triangulate the kidnapper's location. Find them and rescue Victor. Once you've got him, alive, Ewan can bring him back here. And you tell me about Blanco's meeting? I'll tell you when it's happening. Believe me, I want Blanco and Solano taken out as badly as you do. No, you don't. You want Blanco, I want Victor back. We'll pay you. Will you accept the contract? Now, it looks like I got no choice. Besides, I get to kill some of Solano's thugs. I'm in. Dr. Rubin doesn't seem too worried about the fact that the whole country's collapsed and her employees are being kidnapped. Why should she worry? She's got her own jet. First sign of trouble, she'll be back in Texas. The first thing you'll have to do is set up three listening posts so I can get a fix on the kidnapper's cell phone when they call. I've identified the best places for the listening posts. Universal Petroleum Heli Pilot in the air and ready for your signal. This is gonna get hairy, Devlin. You ready to dodge air fire? Sure, I get danger pain. Very nice. Universal Petroleum has oh so generously given us a few support drops you can call in. Enjoy them. Enemy 
BZ soldier.
ready to come save your bacon. I'm taking hits. I gotta go back. Try and stay alive until I get there, eh? One less BZ soldier. That's one post. Good job. I'm taking the car! Oh, I thought you said it was going to get hairy. <laughs> Bring it on. So, Fiona, that's how it works? I call this Irish guy and he brings me what I need. How come I don't have an Irish guy? Well, we agreed to work alone ever since Montenegro. But if you're up for expanding the team, I'll see what I can do. Hostile chopper! to come save your bacon. That's another post. One more to go. What would you do without me? Yona, what's the story? When do I get my own Irishman? I had a lead on a pilot who was working for the PLAV, but apparently they heard about you and East Timor, so no deal. I'm still looking.
hate Venezuela. Hot all the time, shooting at you. Listen, I don't care, man. I'm just in it for the guys. The enemy's here! That's the last post, just in time. The kidnappers have called Ruben. She's patching me in. 
being unreasonable. We should meet and talk about this in person. Is there a coffee shop near you? Mr. Solano made it clear, gringa. If you don't leave Venezuela, we will kill your man. Please understand, I'm on the phone with our head office every 15 minutes, but these things take time. You know how it is. Enough! We gave you the timetable. This is only the beginning. Leave our country or first this man, then others will die. Yeah, I don't think they're buying it. They're gonna kill the executive in minutes if you can't find him first. Okay, I've got a fix on them. We only have a little time before they kill the exec. So, uh, Ewan, was it? Ewan, what kind of deal do you have with UP? Well, you know, the pay's not much, but the benefits are great. And that Reuben Bird's easy on the eyes, you know what I mean? How'd you like to come work for my outfit? I need a helicopter pilot to deliver vehicles and ordnance in the field. I don't know. I'm the type... Better that needs a lot of action, you know? You seem pretty low-key. Yeah. Why don't you give me a ride back to the villa at real time? I can make you an offer. Sounds fair. Let me know when you want. The truck is heavily armored on all sides. It can only be hijacked from the rear. Rescue you. This time. Oh, thank God! Well done! Now get him safely back to Universal Petroleum's modest, unobtrusive little hobble. I'm all set here. Brilliant. Boy, the swing right down. Hop on in, and I'll bring up the nav map for you. All right. Where to, boss? All right, follow me. There's somebody I want you to meet. All right, I love meeting people. Nice. Fair bit of scratch in this place, isn't there? And you are? I am intrigued. But me mum always called me Ewan. Yo, don't shoot him. We need a helicopter pilot. That's me, miss. You must be his support operative. She's my partner, Fiona Taylor. 
Have you ever flown in a war zone before? <laughs> well, not intentionally. Then why should we bring you on? Because I'm charming and clever and the best rotor man in Venezuela. If he annoys you, you can shoot him. We do need a helicopter pilot. Welcome aboard. Ewan moved in. He found a spot upstairs. Tell him I said, nice rug. Oh, hey, boss. Uh, just hanging out. You know, waiting for your call all the way. Hey, boss. While I was flying for UP, I kept hearing about this mechanic named Ava. Everyone seems to hate her. Carmona, Solano, even the gorillas. Figure she's right up your alley. I got something we can bet on. If you got too much discretionary income. I had some lovely Venezuelan ladies here. But I accidentally detonated something in the stockpile. They screamed and ran away. I've got some information on the local guerrilla faction. The People's Liberation Army of Venezuela or PLAV, is a group of leftist radicals, very radical, who've been hiding out in the jungle for decades. They hate Solano enough to risk direct conflict with the VZ army. They're also keen on disrupting Universal Petroleum's business for being willing pawns of the capitalist military industrial complex. This is their leader, Marcela Acosta. She's unusually well-funded thanks to close ties with the People's Republic of China. She's willing to spend some of that money on world-class mercenary talent to achieve results her own man can't bring. And that's where I come in. Remember Yosef in North Korea? I wonder if he's still alive. I keep thinking, if he were here, we could make a lot. Here you go, boss. Put it to good use. Did you see 
Doodles on my Didn't mean to shoot you, sorry. You're about to enter the city of Merida, currently occupied by the Venezuelan army. They're using this city as a base for their operations in southern Venezuela, so you're likely to encounter a lot of resistance. Easy soldier.
if you're ever feeling a little bit lost, come back to the PMC and talk to me. I might be able to offer you a few suggestions. Hey, Ewan. How'd you like to make a quick buck? Send you and right out. Need more ammo! Send you in right out. Unless 
soldier. I need to rest for a second. You bagged an HVT. I best come pick her up. You better have that guy ready to load, man. I don't get paid extra for this.
signal boss. Ready to bag your munitions. We've acquired some fuel. We'll need fuel for just about every support operation in the field. nearby. Remember, they're paying you to verify them. Assume the escort submission position. Get out of the way! A minute, go. Get out of here! Ah! A little banged up. A few more of these, and we can take a holiday. Yeah! Oh, bench. By the way, I ran the numbers, and I don't think we can afford more than three of
Back to work. Chris Jacobs, the indestructible mercenario. The people have need of you. You need help and I need cash. Cut to the chase. I'm in. This is an outpost contract, which means you'll need to take over an outpost command center for the PLAV. They're providing you with a strike team of soldiers who will take over the outpost. When you get close to it, call in the strike team. They'll arrive by chopper and attempt to secure the outpost. I'll tell you more once you get close to the outpost. Soldier.
Commando team, inbound to your position. Commandos inbound. get more work. Also, every time you take over an outpost for a faction, it unlocks a landing zone that you and can take you to. Jacobs! Everyone's been talking about you. I must admit, I'm happy you chose to side with us. You need help and I need cash. Cut to the chase. We need more firepower. Eh, what the hell? Beats working.
that stings a little. Behind that cover! Commando team, inbound to your position. Enemy soldiers approaching! Kill the mercenary! Amateurs! This is scratch. Attack the building! Ah! Ah! Oh! Commando team, inbound to your position. Advancing! Soldier. Mr. Jacobs, I am pleased to see you working with the PLAV. You need help with something? You're on your own for that. Goodbye.
Someone called for a taxi? Okay, let's do this. This is Guanare, or what's left of it anyway. After Solano took over, the army occupied it, threw many of the residents out of their homes and businesses. All right, I've located your target. by Carmona's troops. Yeah, I had a couple of birds all over.
I smile every time I see you, because it means more of Carmona's troops will die. You need help with something? Goodbye. You Ava Navarro? My name's- I know who you are. You're the mercenary. The one Solano shot in the ass. I figured you'd come here. Solano's goon shot me in- What do you mean you figured I'd come here? You're alone? You need help? 
You go through vehicles quick, need them repaired. I'm the best mechanic in Venezuela who also happens to hate Carmona. You hate Solano. Wasn't hard to figure out. You hate Carmona. A lot of that going around. What did he do to you? You'll probably need a helicopter pilot. I've got a helicopter pilot. What do you have against Carmona? Need a jet pilot, too, if you're planning on using airstrikes, which I figure you are. I am. Okay, so you've got a thing against Carmona. As far as I'm concerned, that's all the qualification you need. How about you and I... No, just because I'm anti-Carmona doesn't mean I'm pro-mercenary. No, I guess you were pro-Ava. Okay, you're available. Otherwise, you'd have kicked me out already. You'll join me, but you need something done first. How did you know? A lot of that going around, too. All right, let's give it a shot. There's one last job I must finish before I can close up and help you get Carmona. And Solano. Yeah. I'm building a unique vehicle for a special client. I need help getting the parts, and then when it's done, I want someone to test it out, make sure it works. You can't test it out yourself? Well, the PLAV want to talk to me, and the oil company have a bounty on me. Solano wants me dead. You don't have a lot of friends, do you? And I heard something about a jet pilot hiding out with the pirates. Might be useful to you. And when this is done, you'll join me? Probably. You remind me of me. Okay, I'll do it. Okay, the car's finished. Hop in and take her out for a test run for me. Why aren't you driving? Well, after the last prototype fire, I decided it's safer for me to monitor the test from the garage. these sensors are properly calibrated. Why don't you drive once around the block? So hot What's this big red button on the dashboard? Before. Don't touch any of the instruments. I just need you to drive around the block. Temperature seems fine. Oil pressure is good. Accelerometers are functioning. Now head over to the old strip mine. We can test the off-road capability there. Hey, now that we're out of Ava's sight, let's see what this thing can do. Did you just press the button? Uh, no. My, my hand slipped. That controls a set of hydraulic pumps on each wheel. The whole thing is experimental, so I can't guarantee your safety. Don't mess with it. What is he doing? Quick! 
Okay, the mine has some pretty tough terrain. Let's see how well this baby can handle it. Engine temperature seems fine. Oil pressure... Okay, the mine has some pretty tough terrain. Let's see how well this baby can handle it.
to put this car back together. Engine temperature seems fine. Oil pressure... Okay, the mine has some pretty tough terrain. Let's see how well this baby can handle it.
Engine temperature seems fine. Oil pressure is okay. The mine has some pretty tough terrain. Let's see how well this baby can handle it. Engine temperature seems fine. 
Oil pressure is good. Accelerometers are functioning. Now head over to the old strip mine. We can... Okay, the mine has some pretty tough terrain. Let's see how well this baby can handle it.
performed better than I had hoped. Park the car inside and we'll talk. I like the Universal Petroleum Beacon. They dress well. The people of Merida hold the memory of Bolivar close to our country. And I didn't get it because she knew I had that bottle of chocolate syrup. And she promised... Please shut up. Was that necessary? My apologies. When I saw that painting of Solano, I overreacted. Fiona, this is Ava. She's a... Beautiful. Down, boy. Ava's a mechanic. Uh-huh. Can you do jets and tanks? I can fix anything with an engine. Welcome aboard. Viva the revolution! Do I have to work with him?